Did you have any goals as far as power numbers were concerned coming into the season? Um, I mean, yeah, I wanted to try to hit 20. Um, and and ultimately stay healthy throughout the whole year was, was a big thing for me. And um, I was able to do that today. Pleased by the fact that you were able to do it with a lot of season left to build on? Uh, yeah. I mean, uh, I think me and Judge were talking about it uh, uh, when I had 18. Uh, that you kind of want to go 19, 20, not get stuck on 19. So, um, yeah, it was fun to be able to do it this early. Neil Walker hitting home runs from both sides of the plate. As a guy that swings it from both sides of the plate, can you describe how hard that is to be dialed in and to, and to homer in one game from both sides? Uh, it's special. You know, uh, you know, it was fun to, to see him do it today. You know, uh, you know, uh, I feel like switch hitters are kind of a, a dying breed, and it was fun to see him uh, uh, do it today. Aaron, what's the feeling like in a dugout there in the game like this when everyone is seeing all these balls fly out? Uh, it's fun. I mean, you know, uh, when your team's doing great and, uh, and, and we're winning, it's, it's always going to be fun. John Carlos Dan hit the hardest hit ball since StatCast came into existence in, in 2015. Are you in awe of the way he hits some, he, how hard he hits the ball at times? Or, or what's your reaction when he hits a ball 121.7 miles an hour off the bat? Uh, I mean, I think it was at like 17 degrees or something. So for, for the rest of us, I think that's just a normal base hit. And now for him, it's a homer. So uh, it's special. I mean, uh, the, way, the way that he's able to make contact on baseball is uh, uh, it's God-given.